Earlier today, the Schuyler County Director of Veterans Services lost her job. She says she was told that she was not fulfilling her duties, but she said that she wasn't given any specifics and then given the option to either be fired or resign. WNY's Max Coven was at tonight's Schuyler County Council of Government meeting where there were some questions about her resignation. Max, what can you tell us? Yeah, Nick, Schuyler County Director of Veterans Services Christine Gardner tells us she was unexpectedly dismissed from her post today. This decision has sparked outrage and concern within the local veteran community, raising questions about the future of veteran services in our area. Christine Gardner was the director of the Schuyler County Veterans Service Agency for 11 months before being called into a meeting. She said the meeting was in regards to the PFC Dwyer Fund. To her surprise, Gardner was told she was, quote, not fulfilling her duties as the director and they were letting her go. I am very hurt that I lost my job. I loved my job. I did not see this coming. Did they specify what you were not meeting, what duties you were not succeeding in their eyes? Was it specific? Uh, no, unfortunately, I said, um, I said to Sean, I said, can you give me an example? He said, I can't speak on that. At a scheduled Council of Governments meeting tonight, attendees questioned why Gardner was asked to resign. Can't handle personnel situations in a public What forum. is the time frame that the public will know why Marsh, the reason behind bullshit. Will there ever be? There is no reason to ever be. Gardner said prior to losing her job, she had questioned how funding was being used in the county's Dwyer Fund program. The PFC Dwyer Fund is a state-funded program for non-clinical peer support projects for veterans. There are guidelines on how the money can be used. Veteran Rick Lewis, who serves on the Council of Governments, expressed concern about how losing Gardner will affect veterans' services in Schuyler County. Uh, there's 1,500 veterans in Schuyler County, and we bring in $13 million dollars from claims that have been processed through this Veterans Service Office. And right now there's 210 claims in process for Vietnam veterans with cancer from Agent Orange and other things. And to just have her pulled out and bring all that to a screeching halt is beyond comprehension. When pressed for answers from attendees at tonight's meeting, county leaders said they did not have to share why Gardner was let go. They said they cannot comment on personal issues. Nick.